god. Give me a second here. BRV. Yo. <laughs> okay. <laughs> that was... That was an emergency. The song is called Carefully Planned. Not like this emergency, by the way. It's something happened that we better not talk about. The, uh, kinda. No, we, we're going to talk about this. So, Spider, basically. That's, that's all you have to know. So, there's this thing in Chile. There is like we don't have a lot of dangerous animals in general. Like there's some wild cats, the pumas, that can be dangerous, but you're never gonna see one of those on the city, you know? But there's one thing that is common across the entire country, which are one species of spiders that we call corner spiders. It's a spider that can kill you in like a couple of hours if it bites you. So it was a, a dead or alive situation. I needed to stop everything, you know? It's important. It's not the first time that happened on, on the stream. I definitely know the first time that it happened to pretty much every Chilean. It's something you gotta learn to live with if you are gonna live in a house at least. Or if you live in an apartment and you don't clean it very often. Yeah, it, it's kind of a real emergency, you know? That sucks. Let's do it again. We call it corner spiders because they live on the corners. They do their houses and all that shit. But they are like predators. They actually go hunting. Usually when there is too much heat. Let's say you got a day that is pretty cold and then the next day is pretty hot. Then on the hot day, you're probably gonna see a bunch of them. Or it's more likely for you to find one of them. Because they kind of go hunting on those days. We have several species of spiders. You can recognize them by the speed. Some of them move way faster than others. And corner spiders are the fastest. So that's how you recognize them. They're pretty fast. Like you can randomly see one just running around. And it's almost like it, it notices you and escapes from you. <laughs> yeah. Like, it, it's literally the only dangerous thing we have here in Chile. I mean, apart from earthquakes, volcanoes, you know, those things, but... From a domestic point of view, spiders... Yeah, those are kind of big deal. Without paranoia, you get used to it. You just get used to it. There is a lot of arachnophobic people in Chile. They suffer a lot. I don't suffer that much. Like, I fear them, but it's more like a rational fear because I know I can die if one of them bites me, you know? But it's not an irrational thing that, like, I see one and I panic. No, I, I don't panic, I just gotta go get something and kill it, you know? That's why I did just now. So you gotta kill them, there's no other way, it's, it's you or them. <laughs> They're pretty fast and they hide pretty fast, so when I saw it on the wall running, I said, okay, we gotta stop this. I gotta kill that thing before it disappears. Because that's that's like the meme of Chile. You see a spider, you stop looking at it for like one second, you look again and it's not there anymore. <laughs> so I had my eyes on the spider the, the entire time when I put the music and all that shit. Then I kill it and then I came back here. What was your weapon of choice? This. Napkins. This is pr probably your best weapon. Just grab a napkin and kill it. That's it. Do you want to see it? I actually have the corpse. If you want to see it. It's kind of gross. I think it's here. Is it? Ah, oh, jeez. Yes, it's here. It's not alive, right? Yeah, I don't think it's alive. Alright, so... There it is. I don't think you can see it. 
I don't think the camera allows, but, but that's the corpse. Oh, Jesus. It's not that tiny, but it's not that big either. There you go. It's gross. It might be like this, this size, around this size, I think. Maybe the size of your thumb, around there, but with the with the you know the the legs, and it's, it's you can recognize it. You learn to recognize them because there are other that have like longer legs are are slower. Those ones actually attack the corner spiders, so you actually want them to be alive. So yeah, we, we learn all those things when you when you live in Chile. Just survival tips. I personally always have something in case I see a spider. Because you gotta act fast. If you don't act fast, they just disappear. And then you gotta sleep on the same room, you know? And th that's not a good experience. So I always have like a napkin or something near me. Or you can use like a, a piece of paper, anything that makes a barrier of contact between your hand or whatever you're gonna use to kill it and the thing you're, you're gonna kill it with. But yeah, I think this is like the third time that this happens on a stream. I have dealt with this before. Yeah, you know that the freaking creature almost got behind a piece of furniture. If that would have happened, I would have put like three songs. Ten more songs, yeah. Excuse me? Did everything fail there? Oh my god, I hate it. That was so bad. Oh my god. But yeah, we, at least we, Sheila. Huh, we. I am Chile. No, 